This is the third of 14 videos regarding the prerequisites of the true baptism for the remission of sins and for the salvation of the soul, as it was established by Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior. Mark 16:16. 16, 16. He that believeth and is baptized shall be saved. Well, it sounds simple enough, to believe that is, but if even Satan's demons believe, why aren't they saved? James 2.19 Jesus Christ said precisely who would truly enjoy the promise of salvation. And it's not for those who merely believe that He is the Son of God, that He was risen from the dead and is now reigning, and that He is our Lord and Savior. While speaking directly with His elected apostles, the only ones He charged with His gospel, He instructed them saying, Go ye into all the world and preach the gospel to every creature. He that believeth in that gospel, and is baptized, shall be saved. Therefore, a third prerequisite for the true baptism is to believe in the true gospel of Jesus Christ, which is only given to his elected apostles. Because the person who believes in that true gospel is going to fulfill all of Christ's other ordinances as a prerequisite for eternal life. This is the doctrine of Jesus Christ as it was revealed to his holy apostle of this era, Naason Joaquin Garcia. May God reward you for hearing this one minute truth. Jesus,